coverage from the Virtual Hockey League, your number one source for online 6v6 hockey. Tonight's broadcast is sponsored in part by League Arena Radio and League Arena Television, your official source for VHL news. This broadcast is also brought to you in part by the Penalty Box of Kalalpo, the number one rated show on League Arena. See you at center ice and with the puck drops. Here are tonight's starting lineups brought to you by Ice Band Industries. From Montreal, we have Cycling Skater at left wing. At center is Dad Sue. Right wing is T. Wilkes. At left defense is Vegas Khan. At right defense is Super Bingo. And at goalie, we have Price. For Carolina, at left wing is Billy. Sir Sandman's at center. Right wing is Darth Forsberg. Left defense is 11 11. Right defense is Tango Mango. And in net is Paralyzer. Here's Adam Smythe with the call. Thank you, Whitney. The Montreal Canadiens taking on. Eastern Conference rival, the Carolina Hurricanes. Sandman, Datsuk. Datsuk wins the draw back to Bengus Khan. Centers it, now dumped in by Montreal. The Montreal Canadiens and the Carolina Hurricanes currently sit in 8th and ninth, respectively in the Eastern Conference. Both these teams are trying to establish a hold on the Eastern Conference standings. Now Carolina cycling the puck down low. Millie has the puck on his stick, looking for an outlet pass. Can't find anything. No, it's poked off his stick and picked up by... Uh, Supavico. Supavico passes it up to Twilks. Twilks is looking for it. He passes it back to Khan. Back to Supavico. Supavico with the bomb, but just wide. Picked up by Montreal. Now poked off their stick. Up comes Sandman. Passes up to Forsberg. Gains wide. Dumps it in around the boards. Can't be picked up by Sandman. Instead, it's picked up by Montreal. Now Montreal on the attack. Here comes Cycling Skater. Cycling Skater has it poked off his stick. Both these teams are trying to establish what the other team is going to do defensively. They're going to establish their offense and try to counterattack. Both are pretty good at playing the counterattack game. Now Bengus Khan with the puck, keeping his zone, passes it out to the center. Now picked up by Carolina in, the, in their zone. Up to Forsberg, fights off a stick check, not a millie. Back down to the point. Point to point, shot deflected wide. Nice shot block by Montreal. Now Montreal at center ice, loses the puck at the blue line. Right, Carolina can't maintain the control of the puck either. Both these teams are trap style teams, and both are pretty good in the defensive fundamentals. Now here comes Sandman up the boards. Fights off a stick check. Looks down low, passes the slot, and Millie Millie shoots saved by Price. Millie, who's had a problem with broken sticks his last two games, has vocally said that he's changing his lumber. He went from one company to another company that is not based in Taiwan. Now Sandman wins the draw, but it's picked up by Forsberg, and an errant pass poked off his stick, but recovered by Carolina. Now deep for the dump in, high dump, down the corner, Forsberg picks it up. Looking for an outlet pass, back to the point, shot block and deflected again by Montreal. Here's Twilix, Twilix passes for the right wing cycling skater. Now Datsuk back to the point, back down to Datsuk. Datsuk back over to Twilix, back to Bangus Khan. Now Montreal's starting to cycle the puck, trying to find something down low, can't find anything. Carolina's collapsing down low and forcing everything to the outside. Here's Bangus Khan, being pressured, winds up, fakes a shot, looks, retreats, now it's deflected and picked up by Millie. Now Forsberg on a breakaway. Forsberg comes in on a breakaway, fights off a stick check, saved by Price. Both these teams having chances early. Now a dump in by Carolina as they try to regroup offensively. Montreal with the puck on the breakout. Bangus Khan up the center. Picked up and maintained control by Montreal. Montreal back to the outside and tries to force something in the middle but picked off by Millie. Here's Sandman. Stops, looks around, has it poked off his stick. Now here comes Montreal, pokes it deep into the Carolina zone. Perry kicks it aside, picked up by Tango Mango. Passed up the boards to Forsberg. He, can't, he loses it. Oh, Forsberg gets called for slashing. He loses the puck, and in frustration, he slashes the Montreal opponent. What do you think about that, Whitney? I thought his boom days were over. Hey, he did say he was done being a good, didn't he? Yep. Huh? Montreal the power play. Sandman wins the draw, but is picked up by Twi'leks. 
Or excuse me, cycling skater. Now cycling skater passes over, but it's deflected wide. Montreal can't get anything going. Carolina's PK is out there with fur. Carolina's PK is fighting them off with ferocious. Oh, pack, pass back to the point. Loose puck. Bengiscon picks it up, passes it down low. Montreal still trying to develop a little bit of offensive chemistry. Carolina's forcing him to the outside. High dump in by Carolina, forces Montreal to retreat. Now Sir Sandman gets away with a slash. The player's not very happy about it. He trips up Sandman. Two non-calls. The refs are swallowing the whistles. Tango Mango with the high dump. Sandman was offside, has to regroup. Here comes Montreal on the breakout. Montreal can't handle the puck. And Sandman's getting called for slashing. He snaps the twig. Ooh, Vegas Khan lets Sandman know that wasn't called for. What do you think about that, Whitney? Exactly. Sandman's not supposed to be the goon. She's speechless. She hates goons. Absolutely hates goons. After the first period, 0-0. Zero, zero. Montreal still has about 20 seconds left on a 5-on-3 power play. Some chances early in the first period, but no team was able to capitalize on those chances. Like new kids on the block, these two teams are hanging tough. After one, shots in favor of the Carolina Hurricanes, 2-1. Hits in favor of Montreal, 1-0. Face-offs are at even. Time on attack heavily in favor of the Montreal Canadiens. Three minutes to about two minutes. Penalty minutes. Carolina is making a march to the box. Two two-minute minors. And I'll start for the second period. Millie taking the draw against Datsuk with Sir Sandman and Darth Forsberg both in the box. Millie wins the draw back to... 11-11, 11-11, wisely dumps it deep into the Montreal zone. And Forsberg's out of the box. Now they're back out to five on four. Montreal passes over to the right wing. Cycling skater shoots, but it's saved by Perry. A minute 27 left on a Sandman slashing penalty. Early in the second period. Now Forsberg facing up against Datsu. Forsberg gets tied up. Now it's picked up by the right winger. Now pass down low to Twilks. Twilks passes over to Cycling Skater. Skater back to Bengus Khan, but Bengus Khan misses the pass. Here comes Price, venturing out of the paint. Dumps it back into the neutral zone, but it's picked up by Carolina. Dangerous play by Price. Talk about having faith in your defense. Usually, goaltenders are supposed to be on that little leash and stay in the paint. But he came out to play the puck, keep his offense going. Now intercepted and picked off by Millie. Millie tries a fancy move with his stick, and it's poked off his stick by Bengus Khan. Here comes Cycling Skater. Cycling Skater has it poked off his stick. Now pass back to Super Vico. Super Vico with the shot. Saved by Perry. Loose puck. No whistle. Now there's the whistle. Ooh, Bingus Kong laying out Darth Forsberg. These two have played with each other before in previous seasons. And they got a little bit of a friendly rivalry. Forsberg going up against Datsu. Face off to the right of Perry. Or excuse me, to the left of Perry. Pass intercepted and picked up by 11-11. And Carolina kills off the two penalties. Now Sandman with the puck down low, deep in the zone. Passes to Forsberg. Forsberg can't find anything. Tries a wraparound attempt, but it poked off his stick. In frustration, shoots a backhander and it misses. Forsberg with the tip. Perry, uh, Price with the save. Now Montreal tries to break out of the zone. Here comes 12, or Cycling Skater. Cycling Skater passes back to the point. Shot, saved by Perry. Fifteen minutes, twenty-three seconds left in the second. Scoreless tie. Sam and Datsuk. Datsuk ties him up, but Millie picks up the puck. Passes over to Forsberg. Forsberg drops it back to Sandman. Sandman dumps it deep into the zone. Race for the puck. Picked up by Montreal. Now Millie fighting it off a couple stick checks. Tries to pass to Sandman. Picked off. Puck was loose in the slot. Couldn't be handled by Forsberg. Now here comes Montreal on the breakout. Montreal down low. Can't handle the puck. Picked up by Carolina, dumped out of the zone. Now Forsberg, braces for the puck, presses his man against the glass and says hello to Bengus Khan. Now Sandman tried to stick lift Twilks. Twilks tries to pass in the slot, nobody's there. Picked up by Forsberg. Back to the point, here's 11-11. Back to Tango Mango, Tango Mango shoots deflected wide. 
Pucks poked out the stick in the neutral zone, picked up by Carolina. Now here's Tingle Mango, high dump in. Forsberg chasing. Forsberg trying to pin his guy up against the glass, but misses. Dotsuk over to the Cycling Skater. Cycling Skater loses the puck to Tango Mango. Tango Mango loses it to Twokes. Twokes loses the puck, now picked up by Carolina. Defense is king in this game. 11-11 with the puck, deep in his zone. Passes up the neutral zone. Pass intercepted, but poked off the stick by Carolina. Carolina still maintains control. Oh, Tango Mango shoots! Wrong net! Perry makes a save, doesn't know what Tango is thinking. Now Sandman shoots. Oh, Tater sauce, uh, saved by Price. And shot by Forsberg, tries to go top shelf short side, but Price gloves it. Still scoreless, 6 minutes 43 seconds left in the second period. Both these teams trying to find what offense they can. It's been a defensive juggernaut so far. Here comes Montreal, deep in the zone, passes the slot. Shot deflected and went wide to Perry. Now picked up by Sandman. He wisely dumps it out of the zone, picked up by Forsberg. Forsberg tries to pass it back to Sandman, but is picked off by Bangus Khan. Read the whole thing. Now puck's tipped and broken up in the high slot, picked up by Carolina. Carolina passes the puck in the neutral zone. Sandman takes a wide shot. Looking for a rebound, but the rebound bounces to the wrong side. Sandman with the puck, back down to 11-11. 11-11 winds up, fakes a shot, passes it down low, tries to go around the boards, but picked up by Supervico. Supervico then passes up the cycling skater. But the Montreal Canadiens are offsides. Two minutes left in the second period. Still scoreless. Sandman against Dotsuk. Dotsuk's been in favor of the draws, but Sandman wins that one. Back to 11-11. Tipped wide. Gone into the zone, but picked up by Bengus Khan. Bengus Khan avoids a hit by Forsberg. Uh, tried to do a slap dump in, but it didn't work. And it's poked off the stick. Back out to the neutral zone. Montreal has to regroup. Here comes Twilks. Twilks dumps it high. Picked up by Tango Mango. Back to 11-11. DDD. Now back up to the center. And pass is intercepted and picked up by Forsberg. Forsberg has the puck trying to make something happen. Stick lifts. Stick lifts again. He's dangerous with that stick lift. Either he's going to be successful or he's going to get a two-minute minor for slashing. The end of two. 0-0. Zero, zero in this defensive battle between the Montreal Canadiens and the Carolina Hurricanes. And Whitney went to go get a couple drinks. She's quite bored. After two, shots in favor of Carolina, 4-3. to three. Hits in favor of Montreal, 3-1. Face-offs are even. Time on attack. Still in favor of the Canadians, 4 minutes to 3 minutes. And Montreal is 0-2 on the power play. Have I missed anything, Darth? Honey, on your cell phone? He's supposed to be in the locker room. Now she's calling Darth. We can see we're hurt. What, what, you trying to tell him not to take too many penalties? Face off one by Sam and started the third. Whitney's still on the phone. We do apologize. Now Carolina picks up the puck deep in their zone. Pass attempt is deflected, but gone into the Montreal zone. Now keep them by 11-11 with a weak shot saved by Price. Now, Sandman picks up the puck. Loose puck. Passes pass over to Forsberg. Forsberg shoots. Price saw the whole thing. Save is knocked over to Price's left side. Now picked up by Montreal. Montreal on the counterattack. Shoots point blank. Saved by Perry. What do you think of the game so far there, Whitney? Oh, it's pretty good. A lot of defense. A lot of good defense on there. I was just on the phone with Fart, with Forsberg uh, during the break there. Just trying to get some insight. Uh, says it's real challenging out there. Uh, that was shot was blocked, and it looks like Tango Mango is injured. That's definitely smarting. Bangus Kong has a cannon. Now here's Super Vico with his shot. Either these guys are shooting on net, or they're trying to injure Tango Mango again. Now Tango Mango is going to get looked at here. Hopefully everything's okay. Sam Datsu, one back by Sam to Tango Mango, who's playing a little bit injured. Now picked up by Twilks. Twilks to Bengus Kong. Now poked off his stick by Sandman. Now here comes a three on one. Carolina. Oh, bad pass by Sandman. Sandman picks up the loose change. Tries to wrap around, but Price is there. A little bit of offense coming around on a couple bad breaks. Now here comes Cycling Skater. Cycling Skater with a shot. Saved by Perry. Kicked aside. Bengus Kong with the bomb from the point. Saved by Perry. Loose puck picked up by Carolina. Teams are starting to put the pressure on. 
Here comes Sandman. Dumps it around the boards to Forsberg. Forsberg looking down low. Can't find anything. Millie picks up loose puck. Shoots. Blocked by Montreal. Now here's Twilks. Back to Datsuk. Twilks in the corner. Back to Bangus Khan. Back down to Twilks. Trying to find something down low. Carolina's keeping it to the outside. And Tango Mango's getting called for tripping. Carolina's a little bit undisciplined tonight. What do you think about that, Whitney? I think I better give Dart the call the next intermission. <laughs> they keep playing like they are. There's going to be another intermission. Possibly overtime. And a shot hits the post. Perry's good friend, the man in iron, saves that blistering slap shot in the high slot. Now uh, Montreal still on the power play, regrouping. Here's Millie on a high flip dump. Nope, Millie decides to keep it, fakes the dump. Dangles, looks back to the point, can't find anything. Fakes the shot, poked off the stick. Now Sandman, they're killing the penalty deep in the Montreal zone. It's supposed to be the Montreal power play, not Carolina's. Now picked up by Millie, high flip dump on net. Perry, uh, I'm sorry, Pro Price saves that puck. Now passes through the slot. Montreal's going to be offside. Picked up by 11-11, but poked off his stick. Cycling skater touched it. It is a delayed offside. 43 seconds left in the Montreal power play. Here's a replay of that shot. Went off Perry's shoulder and hit the crossbar. Unfortunate break for Montreal. Lucky bounce for Carolina. A high flip dump. Picked up by 11-11. Now he flips it out of the zone to Sandman. Sandman pressuring Bengus Khan. Bengus Khan passes it over to Cycling Skater. Skater tries to drop pass it to nobody and poked off his stick. Now a high flip dump by Millie. Bengus Khan racing back for the puck. Sandman beats him. Sandman scores. Short-handed wrapped around. Hello Dolovision. We got a new rap star. Here's a little known fact. In the baby seasons, two rules were put in place because of Sir Sandman. Because of his wraparound offense, Sir Sandman is the original rap star. The wraparound rule and the switch of play rule were instated because of him. Before Tim Dalla, there was Sir Sandman. Thank you, Whitney. I did not know that. Sir Sandman, the original beta season rap star, does it again. Carolina's up 1-0. All right, goal scored shorthanded by Sir Sandman. Now picked up, dumped out of the zone on net. Price is coming up to play it. Forsberg's challenging. Now picked up in the neutral zone by Sir Sandman, but a little stick checking back and forth. Now he has the puck, shoots. Price didn't know where that puck's going. He kicked it wide into the corner. Now picked up by Carolina. Sir Sandman tries a hip check, but was unsuccessful. Puck's deflected off his stick. Four minutes left in the third period. Carolina's up 1-0. Now Sir Sandman gains the zone. Tries to stick handle with the puck. He gets it poked off his stick by Bengus Kong. Now passed out to Twilex, the cycling skater. Cycling skater tries to pass to the slot. Nobody there. Picked up by Sandman. Now Millie at the hard jump in. Forsberg racing the puck to get it from Bengus Kong. Pins Bengus Kong up against the glass. Him and Bengus Kong are having some words out there on the ice. There's Sir Sandman. Passes it to Forsberg. Forsberg picks it up. Gains the zone. Tries to handle the puck and gets crushed by Super Vico. Now here's Twilks. Twilks with the puck down low, deep in the corner. Loose puck, can't handle by Tango Mango. Now shot, save puck, still loose. Desperation saved by Perry. Puck goes over the net. Picked up by Twilks. Left in a minute, left in the game. Now Cycling Skater has it down low, looks for someone. Passed across the slot, shoot, score! Less than a minute left in the game. Montreal ties it. 1-1. Wilkes sneaks his way past the defense, high slot, and beats Perry to tie the game with 45 seconds left in the third period, 1-1. Well, we got some communication issues. Somebody doesn't like something center ice, now it's picked up by Carolina. Now here's Millie. Millie with the puck, tries to pass back to the D, but it's picked off a breakaway from Montreal. This could end it. Big save by Perry. Now Sir Sandman with the puck on the breakup. Gains his zone. Before getting hit, he dumps it into the corner. Forsberg chasing it down. Battle with Bengus Kong. Poked off his stick, picked up by Montreal. 17 seconds left in the game. Sandman picks up. A tied 1-1 game. 13 seconds left. Puck deep into the zone. Picked up by Montreal. Poked up the stick by Sir Sandman. Sir Sandman has a puck around the back of the net. Tries to shoot. Deflected. Shot again. Deflected. Save by play. Puck still loose. They're poking it. Puck's up. He scores! 2.2 seconds left. Carolina scores. Sir Sandman again. Mr. Poke check pokes it in. 2.2 seconds left on the clock. Unbelievable. The Carolina Hurricanes giving up a goal in the last minute. 
never say never. They don't say die. They come back. They beat the Montreal Canadiens with 2.2 seconds left on the clock. Sir Sandman scores his second goal of the game. Paralyzed are being congratulated for a hell of an effort. What a disappointing loss for the Montreal Canadiens as the Carolina Hurricanes are indeed victorious. For the three stars of the game, there's Twilks with the only goal from Montreal. The second star of the game, Darth Forsberg with the lone assist on the poke check goal. And tonight's first star, none other than the original rap star, that's right, Sir Sandman. Two goals, no assists, a little bit of a puck hog. Here's a highlight of that wraparound shorthanded by Sir Sandman, the original rap star, as Whitney pointed out. Some missed chances, here's Twilks sneaking in and beating Perry. Defense was asleep on that one, tied it up with less than a minute left in the game, and here's the poke check goal. Look at all the Carolina Hurricanes surrounding Price. It's a wall of black. And they poke, 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 and the puck finally goes in. That's tonight's final score, 2-1. What do you think of that, Whitney? Definitely on the edge of my seat towards the end. Well, kind of a boring game in the first two periods, but they turned it on in the third. For Whitney O'Connor, I'm Adam Smythe. Thank you very much for watching tonight's broadcast of VTN Carolina between the Montreal Canadiens on the road against the Carolina Hurricanes. Stay tuned next week when we keep you covered around the VHL. Good night.